name is Evan Nom, and welcome back to another episode of Finding Paradise. Now, um, let's retry that battle. That was an epic battle. Let's make sure we get Rudog on our side quicker this time, though. You just don't give up, do you? Well, there was this one time with the long line at the grocery store, but here, guess not. All right, well, um, let us defend for her first attack, because, ow, that does a lot of damage if you don't defend. All right, let's attack with the shoe. Ah! That did not do a lot of damage. Uh-oh. Ow. Oh, owie. That really hurt. All right, let's attack with the Armageddon kick. Hiya! Beautiful. Gorgeous. All right, now this is just the battle of wills. Oh boy. Can we, um, let's attack with tornado punch. Hiya! Beautiful. Okay. Okay, here comes the rear dog. This is gonna hurt. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, now we can attack with shoe. Ah! Yeah, rear dog, bring it back to us. Yay! Okay, don't question the dog this time. Rear dog has joined the party. Hooray! Um, let's go, rocket dog. Beautiful! Gorgeous! Uh-oh. Here, here he comes. Ow! Okay, um... Defend. Rudog can... Rocket dog again. And... Kaboom! Oh, they're getting close, getting close. I think one more hit from Rocket dog might do it. Oh, no. Ah-ha! You can't control the dogs no more, madam! Okay, we will defend, and Rudog will rocket dog! Yes! Go, rocket dog, go! Yeah! Defeated. Finish her. Alright, now what? I don't think she's gone, though. Something tells me she ain't gone. She had pretty wings. Well, that was a hoot. I beg to differ. Ah, shoot. Rudog's still up there. Forgot to thank him. But why did he help me? Shouldn't y'all made up beings act in unison of Colin's subconsciousness? Maybe Colin, even Colin himself isn't always so sure of what he wants. But so what? With all that you tempt him with, it's no surprise that he got lost. That's okay, though. He might not know what he wants, but I know what he needs. Oh, jeez. Why can't you let people make those decisions for themselves? You know? Look, you may be a part of his mind, but clearly you don't speak for his entirety. Could it be that you're wrong? Yeah, is it so terrible to be wrong sometimes? I mean, no offense, but you aren't much more than that incomplete copy of Colin back there. In fact, I'm not even sure if there's a point in talking to you right now. After all, you're just an ethereal figment of his imagination that never even exist. existed. Perhaps so. But is that any different from what you're here to do? Oh! She got us there. Eva! Hey, sorry. I had to head out for a moment there. She's all in Colin's head, by the way. Uh, yeah, I'm intimately familiar with that fact by now. But what were you doing? You just bailed out on me. Woo! I was out administering sedatives to curb Colin's brain activity. Not sure how his mental process could override us, but it was getting out of hand. Yeah, just a tad. So that wasn't a Christmas miracle after all. Woo! It took a while to work out the dosage, as we still needed his brain functioning. Seems like it's working, though. The effects should be sinking in more now. But <laughs> wow, just what have you been dealing with over here? Don't ask. Oh! What the heck is that? Just some new code Roxy sent me. She said she saw issues with the machine earlier and knew we'd be in trouble. Wrote it in a patch in the car while Rob was driving, apparently. Pfft, 
show off. Did, uh, did she say anything else about the machine? Aside from you doing a crappy job with the self-repairs? No, not like there was much time to talk. Hmm. Actually, I'm still not sure if Colin is stable enough for this to work yet. Oh. Go get her! Ugh, seems like the sedatives still need to, to sink in a bit more. This isn't good. We don't have the time to wait around anymore. Actually, let me try something. You just wait here, cause uh, she might come back this way. What are you doing? Hmm. Hey, hold on a minute. It's only a matter of time now, isn't it? I might not be able to beat you, but don't count on my compliance. No, I'm not here to... Actually, wait. Whoa! Neil! Now you're the god! <laughs> I mean, you were a god, but now you're really a god! Wow, it worked. What? Now you're bringing me here to get back at me for earlier? No, I brought you here for privacy. This place should be off the record, even from Ava. Uh-huh. And what do you want? Your cooperation. I thought we went over that already. Sure, but now I have something to offer you in return. What can you possibly offer me? Something mutually beneficial, actually. And even if you don't care for it, I have a feeling that Colin would. What's, what's his proposal? How did it go? She never came back this way. Well... How? Pure talent. There's more to this story! Rox has her tricks and I have mine. Okay. No need to overcompensate. Are we good to go then? Yeah, she won't be bothering us any longer. Not that she'd be able to anyway, with the sedative setting in. Well, that effect is only temporary. We have little time as it is. Come on, let's move already while we still can. Dude, okay. What in... Sheesh, are they just spreading hibiscus seeds wherever they go? I mean, I guess... I don't know. What does that mean, though? What does that mean? Mm. There we go. Hey! Perfect! I figured it was something like that. Couldn't quite figure it out right away, though. Alright, well, where is this going to take us then, I wonder? Activate! Alright, now what? Okay, here we go. Whoa! Well, let's go, let's go and see what we find at the vortex of all of this. I have a guess. What's it gonna be, huh? Didn't exactly stick that soft landing, field landing, huh? Not like I had much practice on an actual grass strip. Hmm. So, uh, you think this is a case of schizophrenia? Well, with that, the patient usually has trouble actively distinguishing delusion from reality. But in this case, I get the feeling that he is actually well aware of it. Still can't say for certain, but I'm leaning towards some kind of defense mechanism instead. The more curious question is how she's able to materialize here so vividly. Hmm. Good question. That being said, could she still hear us? Don't know about that, but... This should just be a normal memory playback now. 
Oh, oh, there was more up here. Okay, well, I'm going to save here, and I am going to leave this episode here. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys very, very much, and hopefully I will catch you guys in the next episode. Have a great day, you guys. Stay sweet. Bye-bye.